Okay, what do you call a deer with no eyes? No idea. <laughs> I'm from Saskatchewan, come on. <laughs> Go Riders. <laughs> uh, my name is Andrea and I'm the HR manager at Atomic Cartoons. So I'm in charge of all HR matters and also all of our recruiting. Atomic has about 250 people that work here in Vancouver within the two buildings um, that are located side by side. In Kelowna, we also have Yeti Studio. So all combined, you know, there's you know between 250 and 300 people. To apply for a job at Atomic, um, what best way to do is on the job description, click on the link and that will guide you to where you need to enter your information. What you need to send is your resume and then also the link to your demo reel or your portfolio depending on which job you're applying for. The best way for us to view your demo reel is to send us the link to whether you have it posted on YouTube or Vimeo, it doesn't matter. Um, it can be on your own website as long as we have the link. I basically don't want a demo reel that's uploaded to your email. <laughs> I want a link to an external site, which is the easiest. Once somebody's applied to Atomic, um, we do receive all those applications and I review them. So if you don't hear back right away, it could be something that we don't have a role open right at that time. You know, we do our best to try to get back to everybody, but you know, the reality is, is that there are a lot of applications. So as much as our intention is to get back to everybody, you may not hear from us for, for a while. Atomic does have internships for new grads and for people in school. We generally do a few over the summer months. Um, you can apply throughout the year, but most often we will have people come in and work directly on our productions. We have people in usually for four weeks, um, and you know if you're interested in animation, we'll have you animating on a show. Um, sometimes we have space for somebody in storyboard, so it will really depend on what our needs are for the production because we want to get you in there working and seeing what it's like to work in a studio. Internships are paid internships, so uh, you will be earning a paycheck during your time here. Hiring for foreign workers or international employees is a question we get asked quite a bit. 99% um, of the time we do not hire foreign workers, so the majority of our crew is made up of Canadian citizens or permanent residents. We look for people who are also BC residents for the majority of our uh, productions. So uh, the short answer of the long answer is generally no, we aren't looking for foreign workers at this time. That could change at some point, but for now. Mm -hmm.